Hello guys, welcome back to some more God of War Ascension. In the last episode, we made our way through the furnace and managed to repair the statue of Apollo. Well, almost repaired the statue of Apollo anyway. And the lantern has now been risen out of the water as a result of us repairing the statue of Apollo. And this episode now is now time to make our way out of the furnace and make our way toward the lantern. We're still one step ahead of the Furies for now. I just hope it stays that way. Now the whole furnace is fully activated once again, it's now time to make our way out to this furnace. So we need to get this platform moving a rot and get to the top of the statue of Apollo. Things are looking very promising for us right now. To rise this platform, we need to throw enemies into that fire. Yeah, some enemies are going to be harder to throw than others, but we'll get them in the fire. I throw them? No, perhaps not. Okay, I perhaps I have to kill this enemy and then wait for another Tifa to appear. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay, maybe not. Another one of these enemies to deal with. Yeah, these enemies I'm going to have no chance throwing, so I'm just going to have to take them out and wait for a temper to appear. Shame I can't throw them off here, actually. Okay, let's finish this one off. Okay, maybe not. Okay, so I'm going to have to stun him quite a bit if I want to throw him into the fire. If I do a nice amount of damage, I should be able to throw him at some point. Ah, here we go. Oh. Okay, I can't throw him. That's annoying. Nope. Copy way I can somehow throw him in that fire. Hang on. That's if I tried this. Ah, that did it. There we go. That done it. Perhaps it's handy. I've got the shield right now. I picked up a shield by accident in the last episode. I didn't intend to, and I think honestly it's quite a good job I did. I need to grab this one though. Come here, bud. Go. Oh, oh no. If I can stun these enemies enough, I can then get them into the fire. Or, just, or I should just grab this fella here. Getting closer to the top. Funny made it out of there. We're almost getting to the top. Then once we're at the top, we can make our way onto the lantern. Some magic there. Do I need some magic? Yes, I do. I need some magic. Just hoping that Kratos still stays in place while I activate this. Go on, Kratos, put you back into it. Let's 
continue making our way to the top. They've got big enemies doing now too. Oh, so these platforms are going to come with lights on fire now, aren't they? So I've got to really watch out for that. Got to be really careful here. Oh no. I'm going to need... Ah. So if Oxo's guys then move... Oh shit, too early. Shit, too late. So I'm going to get magic ability on this guy. As he's quite a big fella. This should do some damage. So I need to get I need to get this thing. I need to get rid of that big guy first. Yeah, we'll get rid of him. Side tails when Dublin's bound to appear, but we'll worry about that in a minute. Aha, he's stunned. Come in. No! Oh shit, how the fuck that up? I need to take him out. Ah, oh, he's dead. Alright, fine. That'll do. Did finish him off the way I wanted to, but at least he's taken out. I'm going to throw this guy in the fire. Come here. There we go. Raise this up again. Raise this up a bit more. It's a good job I really have got to shield for this, actually. I just need to make sure I'm in the right place to do this. Keep hitting them with shield and eventually they'll fall into the fire. Ah, crap. Nope. Oh, that did it. <laughs> he was stunned enough so I can actually grab him. Uh oh. Oh, we've got another big fella. Fuck a stove, this. Hmm. Grab this big guy out, but I'm going to keep using the shield and try and get these guys into the fire. Oh, that big image up here, didn't they? Well, I'm going to grab this fellow and throw him into the fire. There we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Almost rolled down to my death then for a second. As there's no fire, I'm going to take care of these enemies right now. Hey, I'll try to slow down, but it didn't work. Ah, right, here we go. Get out of here. No! How's I fuck it up again? I'm not having a good day today with combat. Okay, that's all of them. More of them are going to appear, I guarantee it. Hello there. In the end, I just decided to restart that encounter because it was just taking way too long for the enemies to reappear. Even if I did keep taking them out, I just didn't even know if the platform was going to rise. So in the end, I, I thought the best thing to do would be just to restart the encounter. At least we're finally at the top now, though. I'm definitely going to need to refill my health after that encounter. Uh, I think I'm all, I'm all right for magic, mostly, but I may as well have full magic before we get out of the furnace. And quickly get myself some more orbs. As we get to the end of the game, every time we open up chests, we get so much orbs now. Sure, can we make sure there's not anything over here, like in terms of chests? I don't think there is. I'll just have a quick look. No, I didn't think there would be. But I thought I'd have a look anyway, just in case. There's our lantern. We need to repair this.
I need to stand in a certain spot to activate this. A few moments later. Ah, here we go. I have to be standing on this. And Apollo's finally got his head back. And we've got more enemies, so of course we do. So now that platform's been risen, we've got now need to line up the eyes. We need to line up those lights into Apollo's eyes. Yeah, I remember this bit. Can activate this quickly. There we go. Definitely one of the souls of Hades. Definitely the best magic ability to use, in my opinion. Go, got rid of them. Is that all of them? No. Uh, of course not. Hopefully, I don't have to restart this encounter for whatever reason. I hope this encounter will go a lot smoother than the last one. Here we go. Is that all of them? Get him out of the ground? I don't think so. You're not hiding from me. Ooh. Oh, I was going to activate my meter then, but no. Ah. Go. And we got a big fella. Cast on last man damage from there. We go to finish this sucker off. He's down. I've uh, got another one of these. Another one of these guys. Finish this guy off. Hopefully, this there's the last enemy here, then I can hopefully begin shining the, the light into the eyes of Apollo. Is that all of them? No. How many of these enemies are we going to deal with? At least I'm getting a lot of balls from this time. I'll take these enemies out, there's that at least. I'm just going to do this again. Hope I should be able to take the send me out in a minute once I enough damage to him. Here we go. I knew it was coming. I 
finish both these enemies off. This should be the last enemy, hopefully. Is that all of them? Yes, it is. Finally. Okay, so I need to make my way up. So I think we'll head up this way first. I think we need to head up here first, if I remember correctly. Okay, that's been done. What does this do? Ah, now the light's in place, I see what I need to do actually. I see what I need to do. So I need to get on top of the platform on the other side. And you'll see what I'm going to do. It'll be easier just for me to show than just to explain it. We have this chest up though. Nice amount of orbs. Definitely going to need it. I need to have a look at me and see what else I can upgrade. Oh, we've got some chests. Nice. I need one more Phoenix Feather to upgrade my magic. And just one more Gorgonite. If I could find one more Gorgonite, one more Phoenix Feather in this Let's Play, that would be not too shabby. Okay, I need to find a perfect time to put our clone Kratos onto this thing. There we go. So now I need to quickly get back down here as quick as I can and get this other thing activated. Come on Kratos, we ain't got much time. So now I need to activate this quickly before Kratos reaches the other side. Only just made it in time. The eyes are now shining on the lantern. This creature's still alive, I'm impressed. Well, it was only waiting for Kratos to get inside the lantern at this point. Yes, yeah, so unfortunately, this poor unlucky soul can now no longer fly, and in a few minutes' time, he's no longer going to be alive anyways. I've got the Ice Poseidon, I don't want Ice Poseidon, I want my Soul of Hades out. My favourite blades. Ah. Yeah, dude, this is stunning. Yeah, 
Yeah, this guy's a big fella. It might take quite a few hits to take him down. He might use some better combos and stuff. What's this? Oh, he's got friends now. Lucky us. Yeah, this should do a nice amount of damage. Ah, he's stunned now. Maybe he doesn't start attacking me. She's bound to do. Whoa, that was close. Almost didn't see that coming. That's him gone. Now she's got to take out these two. There we go. Is that all of them? Before we head out, I'm just going to quickly see if there's anything over here. Anything? No, I just want to make sure it's anything on this side. Any chests or just anything? Okay, other side's over there. So let's go have a look over here and see what we've got over here. Not much further now, Spartan. Inside there are the eyes of truth. The very same eyes my mother's ruthlessly pulled from Alethea. When I learned of the plot between my parents to overthrow Olympus, I could not believe Alethea's words. Then she showed me the truth. That the god of war would bring down the very walls of Olympus. I knew I must stop them. Alethea and I sought to warn Zeus. But when Ares learned of our attempt, he sent my mothers after us. The eyes were brutally ripped from my beloved. She became a prisoner in her own temple. Ares and my mothers knew that if the eyes of truth were hidden, then their wicked plot would not be revealed. Then soon they would reign over the gods themselves. To keep their plan in motion, they need you back, Spartan. They will stop at nothing until you return to Lord Ares. Ares will have to find another to do his bidding. I know he will set things right. Eyes of Truth. Pass from Oracle to Oracle. These eyes can see through the dark magic of the Furies. That will definitely come to our aid. Okay, so now we're at the Lance of Delos. This will now be a good time to end this episode off and continue things off in the next episode. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you all for watching. If you guys enjoyed the episode, please be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe. And keep up to date with the God of War Ascension episodes that to my channel. And the next episode will surround the Lance of Delos. And hopefully we can make our way to the Furies. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you for watching. This is GoldieX and I'm out.